Hey everybody, this is Shane. I have another Airsoft review for you today. Now, this is also going to be my 100th video on my channel, so yay to me 100 videos. But, this is the Beretta Model 12S made by Umarats. It's the same company that did the 92 that became my first Airsoft review on my channel. Now, a few things I'm going to point out about the weapon itself. First off, this is spring operated. Um, I know with .12 gram pellets, it has a muzzle velocity of 250 feet per second. I'm not sure what the muzzle velocity is with this with .2s, which is what I always do my reviews with is with the .2s. But um, this is an this is a licensed replica by Umarets. Matter of fact. Right up here, it's it's marked up like a real Beretta. It's marked PM Beretta, model 12S, Cal 9mm Parabellum. Then it's got a faux serial number followed by dash 87. I guess that's supposed to be the year of manufacture for the weapon. Then on the other side, right here, it's got an actual serial number right here. And right here, it's got Cal 6mm Energy uh, 0.5 Joules. Beretta trademarks, licensed by Beretta Italy, made for Umarets, Germany. Then right down here, more prominent, which from the look of it, I'd, I'd safely say that can be rubbed off just from use. But, it's, but it says, warning, not a toy. Wear eye protection to prevent serious injury to the eye. Before using, read owner's manual, available from Umarets USA, Fort Smith, Arkansas. UmaretsUSA.com, made in Korea for Umarets. Beretta trademarks, licensed by Beretta Italy. Now, first off, uh, this retailed at my local Academy Sporting Goods for about $36.99. And I'll be honest, um, I wasn't really displeased with this, especially at that price. Now, if I had any complaints, it is this. The Beretta Model 12, now right here, normally would be a little wire folding stock, but that's omitted in this case, as this is basically an oversized spring pistol. Now, it does have slain mounts in the very back that fully rotates. It also has another one close to the muzzle of the weapon right here, and that fully rotates. Now, as for the sight picture on this, there we go. It's an aperture rear sight with an exposed center post front sight. This does have one more, but there it is. So, if you're going to be aiming down the sights, that's how you're going to be using this with this aperture rear sight. And honestly, just from the little bit I've shot this, for me, it's better off with a stock, but other than that, I really got no complaints about this. Now, the safety is right here. You flip up towards the S, and it engages the safety. It will not fire. Flip down here towards the F, and it'll fire. Now, this right here, on a real Beretta Model 12, um, this is your grip safety. And unless that's engaged, it prevents the weapon from accidentally discharging. And it also keeps you from uh, actually pulling the trigger. But that's just for um, that's just for display. That's not an actual safety. Matter of fact, the way you actually charge this one, on a real Beretta Model 12, your charging handle is right here. Now as you can see, hold on. there we go. Right down through here is a little... Uh, recess spot or show where the bolt would slide, you know, slide back. But what what they did, which I thought was weird at first, but after fooling with it, I thought it was actually ingenious. Uh, your forward grip um, is how you cock it, and it basically turns this into an a pump action pistol. Now. As I said about this safety right here just being there for looks, well, 
as you heard, I can fire this without even engaging that right there. But, um, that's about it for the weapon itself. As for the magazine of the weapon, as I said, I use .2 grams in any of my airsoft reviews. Now, the front portion of the magazine right here holds 23 pellets. However, right back here, there's actually a little door right here that you can open. And this is actually a reservoir. This holds an additional 166 additional pellets. So, overall you're talking 189 pellets that can be held in this magazine. And you can actually, um, like most of your inexpensive airsoft guns, reload the magazine from the, from the little reservoir. All you do is, there's a little tab right here, just pull this up and lock it to the side. There we go. And just, what I do is I generally hold it like so, shake it, and it just feeds automatically for me. But... This always gives me trouble right here. Hold on. There we go. But, now for the next question is, how accurate is this particular air pistol? Well, I have a few cans that are actually set up over here. Now, I'm shooting at a distance of approximately 10, 12 feet. Hold on, I'll actually bring this in so you can actually see the weapon itself at work. Alright. It's pretty accurate. Now, this does have one more additional feature. I am just going to show off. I'm somebody, uh, kind of like with some older model shotguns, you can slam fire this one. In other words, just hold down the trigger, work the action, and it automatically fires. Now, I'm just going to be doing this just for sheer speed. I'm not going to try and go for accuracy. And as you saw, I was able to get multiple shots out very quickly. But, I mean, overall, this really isn't that bad of a um, of an inexpensive airsoft pistol. But what's my overall verdict on this one? It's a solid go. It's a officially licensed replica by Umarets for Beretta. I mean, this is very, it's a very light airsoft pistol. As you saw, it's very accurate even when I was just doing the slam fire. I wasn't trying to go for accuracy, but I was hitting my mark most of those times. Um, it's not it's not horribly priced. Like I said, it's $36.99 at my local Academy Sporting Goods, but... Overall, for me, it's just an absolutely dead solid airsoft gun. Um, Umarets, in my opinion, has actually done another fantastic job as far as their airsoft guns go. Overall, if you like weapon replicas, if you like Beretta, get it. But I don't see too many spring-powered versions of the Beretta Model 12, to be, per to be perfectly honest. But this is just my take on the Umarets Beretta Model 12S. You have a good day.